Good evening, and welcome to the William E. Kate chapter of the National Honor Society induction ceremony. The National Honor Society is the nation's premier organization established to recognize outstanding high school students. More than just an honor roll, National Honor Society serves to recognize those students who have demonstrated excellence in the areas of scholarship, service, leadership, and character. Therefore, a student does not only need to be outstanding in the classroom, but be able to be a leader and make a difference in the community as well. Tonight, please join me in congratulating our 2020-2021 National Honor Society inductees. At this time, I would like to introduce our superintendent, Mr. Francisco Rodriguez. The pursuit of excellence is a daily choice to do and be the very best that you can be. It requires discipline and sacrifice. And in return, the rewards most often gained are opportunities that are earned in no other way. The path to greatness is a path forged by a will to do what must be done. Tonight, as we celebrate these distinguished scholars, we also recognize the parents, guardians, and loved ones that have sacrificed and done what's necessary to guide and propel these students towards greatness. The students that are distinguished here tonight, and we honor, have not only achieved superior academic standing, they have contributed to their school community as leaders in clubs, sports, and civic volunteer duties. Above all things, they have remained steadfast and committed to the ideals of the National Honor Society. They have added to the legacy of the Greenway and have earned a place among the best of the best here at the Long Branch Public Schools. They represent the students from the past and present who proudly call the Green Wave home. Together we can. Now, may I present to you the 2020-2021 National Honor Society officers. President Julin Thompson. Vice President Stephanie Silva. Secretary Eva Izaguirre. Treasurer Caitlin Egan. We will now introduce our new inductees. Lacey Armour is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society as it celebrates her academic achievements. She is also excited that the National Honor Society offers her more ways to get more involved in her school and community while also being a role model for her friends and family. Lacey continues to volunteer at the Ronald McDonald House. Working with these families and young children has contributed to her future career aspirations. In the future, Lacey plans to work in the field of neuro or pediatric surgeon. She hopes to attend Princeton or Stockton University. Congratulations, Lacey. Amelia Becerra is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it provides her with more opportunities to be a leader, volunteer, and give back to the community. 
while setting examples for the next generation of individuals. Through Amelia's commitment to Marching Man, she has been afforded a number of volunteer opportunities that have impacted her connection to the community. Amelia aspires to be a general practitioner and attend Harvard University. Congratulations, Amelia. The Osneri Balia is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it demonstrates that hard work pays off. She is also proud that being part of the National Honor Society is a great honor that only few can say they achieved and believes that her acceptance opens a new door for her future. For a number of years, the Osneri has volunteered at a daycare facility serving the elder population. She believes that this opportunity has inspired her to work with people in her future aspirations. Diosneri wants to attend Rutgers University and aspires to be a psychologist. Congratulations, Diosneri. Maya Brown is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it will help build her character and give her the opportunity to continue helping others. She looks forward to being a part of a group that will motivate her to perform at her absolute best in all of her academic endeavors. Maya identifies her volunteer work at the Ronald McDonald House as the most influential because she was able to witness and provide for families of infants during the hardest times. Maya Rose Brown looks forward to studying at a historically black college or university. She aspires to be a preschool teacher. Congratulations, Maya. Jada Buzzy is excited to be a member of National Art Society because she wants to be a leader and role model for her peers. She also looks forward to being involved in more service opportunities around the community and the school. Jada prides herself on being able to inspire the youth through cheer mini clinics at our elementary schools. Jada hopes to become an environmental scientist and attend Howard University. Congratulations, Jada. Ava Saruhis Gazon is excited to become a member of the National Honor Society because a prestigious organization recognizes students for their altruism, leadership, and academics. She also looks forward to being involved in more service opportunities around the community and the school. Ava prides herself on being able to inspire and give back to the youth in our community. Ava aspires to becoming a lawyer or doctor. She hopes to attend Princeton, Yale, or Columbia. Congratulations, Ava. Anna Dos Santos is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because she wants to be a leader and a confidant for her fellow classmates. Anna spends most of her extra time volunteering and cleaning for local beaches. This opportunity has allowed her to see how damaging pollution can be to the earth. Anna aspires to be a pediatrician. She hopes to attend John Hopkins University. Congratulations, Anna. Jaden Farmer is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because he will have more opportunities to serve his community. He is also honored to be a member of the National Honor Society because it recognizes individuals who are respectful, responsible, and dedicated. Jaden recognizes his commitment to the community and his desire to continue to give back to others. This can be identified in his extraordinary efforts to provide food to the homeless during the holidays. He aspires to be an accountant. Jaden hopes to attend Rutgers University or the University of Maryland. Congratulations, Jaden. Ricardo Flores is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it is a way to further help his community through volunteerism and community service. Through Ricardo's commitment to the marching band, he has been afforded a number of volunteer opportunities that have been impacted his connection to the community. Ricardo aspires to be a doctor or an engineer and hopes to attend Rutgers University. Congratulations, Ricardo. Matthew Freer is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because he believes being part of this group will better prepare him for his future, not only academically and socially, but also help him build good character and be a productive member of society. An opportunity that has impacted him the most was his involvement at his local church, providing assistance in Bible education. Matthew aspires to become an electrician or a civil engineer. He hopes to attend Kane University. Congratulations, Matthew.
Maylin Gonzalez is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because this is something that she has wanted to be a part of since she was in middle school. She also sees it as an opportunity to help in accomplishing many goals. Maylin has volunteered with the marching band that has allowed her numerous opportunities to give back to the community. Her most inspirational being fight songs for food. Maylin aspires to study computer science and software design. She hopes to attend a four-year college or university. Congratulations, Maylin. Andrea Guevara Gonzalez is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because this is something that she has wanted to be a part of since entering high school. She also sees it as an opportunity to help in accomplishing many goals. One opportunity that has impacted Andrea is her desire to assist younger students. Andrea aspires to be an engineer and hopes to attend El Salvador University. Congratulations, Andrea. Mitzi Hurtado Velasquez is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it is a connection to the community. The one that has impacted her the most is gathering food at a local grocery store for the less fortunate. Mitzi aspires to be an orthodontist and attend Mammoth University. Congratulations, Mitzi. Alexander Jackson is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because he looks forward to being a part of a group that shares similar worth ethic and leadership qualities, which will motivate him to perform at his absolute best in all of his academic endeavors. Alexander identifies assisting at a Lutheran church as one of the volunteer opportunities that has impacted him the most. Alexander would like to pursue a career in manufacturing. He would like to attend a four-year university. Congratulations, Alexander. Day is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it is a prestigious honor that recognizes academic achievement, service to his community, and leadership. A number of opportunities that have impacted Keegan have been afforded through the marching band, where his passion has assisted in giving back to his community. He aspires to major in forensic chemistry after high school. Keegan would like to attend West Virginia University or Rutgers University. Congratulations, Keegan! Emma McGill is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because she enjoys the volunteering aspect of the organization and likes getting involved in helping other people. She also appreciates the recognition of her leadership skills and character. Emma has volunteered at a local blood drive for a number of years. Emma aspires to be an English teacher. She hopes to attend Princeton University. Congratulations, Emma. Journey Mills is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because of the organization's positive reputation for focusing on serving the community. Journey continues to volunteer with local organizations that help in preparing and delivering hot meals within the community. Journey aspires to work in the field of culinary. She hopes to attend the Culinary Institute of America in New York. Congratulations, Journey. excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it allows her to give back to her community. Through serving others, it also gives her the opportunity to continue growing as an individual. Brianna has spent countless hours volunteering throughout numerous activities that have helped her in giving back. At the present time, Brianna has a few career choices in mind. She plans to attend a four-year college or university. Yadira Ortiz Lopez is excited to become a member of the National Honor Society because of the organization's positive reputation for focusing on serving the community. As a member, she wishes to continue helping others and her community. Through Yadira's commitment to Creative Sewing, she has been afforded a number of volunteer opportunities that have impacted her connection to the community. Yadira aspires to become a physical therapist and plans on attending Brookdale this fall. Congratulations, Yadira.
Daisy Pacheco Ortiz is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it demonstrates that hard work pays off. She is also proud that being part of the National Honor Society is a great honor that only a few people can say they have achieved and believes that her acceptance opens a new door for her future. For a number of years, Daisy has volunteered at a local church. Daisy aspires to be a civil engineer or an architect. Daisy wants to attend the New Jersey Institute of Technology. Congratulations, Daisy. Morgan Priester is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it is a nationally recognized organization that values a combination of academics, leadership, and commitment. Morgan recognizes his commitment to the community and his desire to give back to others. This can be identified in his exalting efforts through the Community Balance Foundation. Morgan aspires to join the local 400 trade union for electricity with the intent to run the family business. Congratulations, Morgan. Emily Pustum is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it is a prestigious honor that recognizes academic achievement, service to her community, and leadership. An opportunity that has impacted Emily is her participation at Autism Awareness Walks, where she has been able to assist kids of all different backgrounds and be deemed a role model. She aspires to be a lawyer. After high school, Emily would like to attend Monmouth University. Congratulations, Emily. Mary Amir Ramirez is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it signifies that you are a leader, not only in school, but in your community. She is also proud that she will have the opportunity to continue to display good character and serve others. Mary Ami identifies her letter writing to soldiers and children that are ill as an opportunity that has impacted her the most. Mary Ami would like to become a lawyer, judge, or politician and hopes to attend an Ivy League college or university. Congratulations, Mary. Eva Ramos is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because she believes being part of this group will better prepare her for her future not only academically and socially, but also help her build good character and be a productive member of society. An opportunity that has impacted her the most is her involvement with preparing meals and delivering them to local hospitals for families in need. Eva aspires to be a medical surgeon and plans to attend a university in Mexico. Congratulations. Angelina Reyes is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it provides her with more opportunities to be a leader, volunteer, and give back to the community while setting an example for the next generation of individuals. She identifies assisting with dinners at her local church as one of the volunteer opportunities that has impacted her the most. Angelina plans to study criminal justice and hopes to become a behavior analyst. Angelina would like to attend Boston University. Congratulations, Angelina. Alex Rodriguez is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it provides him with the opportunities to continue the impact of the community surrounding him in addition to improving upon his leadership skills. Alex has appreciated his time spent volunteering at the local blood drive. His career aspiration is to become a nurse. After graduating high school, Alex hopes to attend a four-year university. Congratulations, Alex! Jessica Sanchez Marcello is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because she enjoys the volunteering aspect of the organization and likes getting involved and helping other people. She also appreciates the recognition in her leadership skills and character. Jessica has volunteered at our local hospital, assisting in whichever capacity that is needed. Jessica hopes to attend New York University with the intent to own a business. Congratulations, Jessica. Nisby Santiago Reyes is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because many times in her life she received support from her community. Through volunteering, Nisby learned patience and support goes a long way. She would like to attend a four-year college or university. Congratulations, Ms. Me. Donald J is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because he looks forward to being a part of a group that shares similar work ethics and leadership qualities. 
which will motivate him to perform at his absolute best in all of his academic endeavors. For a number of years, Donald has volunteered at the local hospital to provide assistance to anyone who may need it. Donald would like to pursue a career in botanical or agricultural engineering. He would like to attend Cornell or Rutgers University. Congratulations, Donald. Leanne of Descent is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because it gives her the opportunity to connect with new people and continue giving back to the community. She also would like to continue developing her leadership skills. A volunteer opportunity that has impacted her the most was working at the local food pantry. Rihanna aspires to become a part of the healthcare field and attend the Meagle University in Montreal, if not a college or university in New Jersey. Kelsey Zimmerman is excited to be a member of the National Honor Society because she believes being part of this group will better prepare her for her future, not only academically and socially, but also help her build good character and be a productive member of society. Kelsey continues to volunteer with local organizations that help in preparing and delivering hot meals within the community. Working with these families and young children has contributed to her future career aspirations. Kelsey aspires to become a teacher. She hopes to attend the University of Rhode Island or the College of Charleston. Congratulations, Kelsey. At this time, will the new inductees raise your right hand and repeat after me. I pledge to uphold, I pledge to uphold the high purpose of the National Honor Society, the high purpose of the National Honor Society, to which I have been selected, to which I have been selected, I will be true to the principles for which it stands. I will be true to the principles for which it stands. And will always maintain and encourage. And will always maintain and encourage the high standards. The high standards of scholarship. Of scholarship. Leadership. Leadership. Service. Service. And character. And character. At this time, I would like to introduce our lead principal, Mr. James Brown, with closing remarks. Good evening, Mr. Rodriguez, members of the Board of Education, Central Office Administration, honored guests, family, and friends. I welcome you here tonight to our virtual ceremony and thank you for joining us in celebrating the accomplishments of our students. The National Honor Society induction ceremony is always a special occasion as selection as a member of this group truly captures the ideal of being a well-rounded student. To our newly inducted National Honor Society members, this evening you are being honored and recognized for your dedication and commitment to excellence. Your selection into the National Honor Society is based upon your efforts towards building a strong foundation in the society's four pillars of scholarship, character, leadership, and service. Now that you have achieved this status and demonstrated that you possess the qualities worthy of this honor, your journey does not end with this ceremony. Your challenge from this night forward is to continue to honor the commitments you have made to uphold the standards of this prestigious organization. Additionally, your challenge is to positively impact our school community by embracing your role as leaders and exerting your influence on those around you to help them excel. While it would be easier to rest on past achievements, your mission is to improve upon the contributions of our previous Honor Society members. I look forward to your continued growth and your future contributions towards the betterment of our school. On behalf of the administration and faculty of the Long Branch High School, I commend you for your efforts and offer my congratulations. To our current National Honor Society members, for you, this evening is a celebration of a different nature. This evening, we recognize and honor all that you have contributed toward upholding the values and standards of this esteemed group. Since your induction, you have worked hard and diligently to meet the challenge of remaining true to your oath by continuing to serve others, demonstrating impeccable character, and choosing a path of leadership and responsibility. In doing so, you have upheld the standards of excellence for this organization and shape the blueprint for the new members to follow. As you move forward, the new challenge for you is to continue to push yourself to excel while always remembering 
the foundation you established as members of the Long Branch Public School community. On behalf of the administration, faculty, and your fellow students, we thank you for your dedication to the National Honor Society and wish you well in your future life experiences.